First chapter of Mark, verse 15, records Jesus saying, the time has come, the kingdom of God is near, repent and believe the good news. Have you ever noticed how sometimes we keep on making the same mistakes? Or do you look to others and ask, will they ever learn? Perhaps that's because we miss the significance of those moments God provides for us to grow and learn. When Jesus said the time has come, he wasn't talking about the day or the hour, but the significant moment. He used the Greek word kairos, a kairos moment when God's kingdom is upon us and we have the opportunity to learn. The th key thing is looking for that kairos moment, that significant event. It could be a positive event or a negative event. It's never a neutral event. It leaves an impact on you and it signals an opportunity to grow spiritually and emotionally. And then with prayer to enter into the circle of learning. First to repent, literally to change one's mind, to change the way we think about something. And then three steps to faith. Faith is about doing something. The circle shows how we can learn from our Kairos moments. The first thing we do is change our mind to repent. And in doing that, we observe what happened and how did we react. Then we reflect on our observations. Why do we feel the way we do? What does that say about us? Is there a pattern going on in my life? And then discuss by seeking the wisdom of others. Do your observations and reflections make sense? Do you discern an opportunity for growth? And then to plan to figure out a practical way to grow. To account, to tell someone about your plan and ask them to follow up with you on it so that you do what you plan to do. Set a new regime in place and then get someone to check that you're doing it and the final step is to act to simply do it an example of a kairos moment could be that you've got spiraling credit card bills the circle might go like this what am i buying each month that's your observation and do i need it the reflection what does this say about me am i buying stuff to make myself feel good Am I buying stuff about identity? The next thing is to discuss, is to say, hey, I seem to be having this problem. I'm feeling that money's got a hold over me. What do you think? And then to work out a plan. I'm going to cut up all my credit cards, but one, and I'm going to limit my spending to say 200 pounds a month. Then the account, hey, can you come and help me? I'm, I'm doing this, I'm going to cut my credit card bills, I'm going to limit my spending. Can you keep a check on me? Can you keep saying, how's that spending going? And then finally, act. That is, cut up the credit cards and stop buying. That's a simple example. I believe at this particular moment, during the COVID crisis, we've got a massive opportunity, a massive Kairos moment to stop to think differently and to move forward in faith. So let's learn from life.